so hi awesome people so today I'm undoing my hair so this was done in a salon uh, by my hairdresser so I had a style that I had put on this two lines so just as you can see below so I'm just undoing my hair so today's um, video is on uh, how I undo my hair and detangling it so at this point I'm just uh, undoing the style yeah The first half and the side looks so I'll continue with the other half uh, so that you guys can see the whole of my hair I'm just checking on my lips yeah <laughs> so I'll just finish up on the other half god our neighbors it's early in the morning and I don't know what they are pulling or pushing. They're always up to something. So yeah, if you hear some sound, they're probably my neighbors. So yeah, this other half is almost done. Uh, I had to speed up the video a little bit. I really don't think that was important like I'm doing my hair most of you undo your hair but I just wanted to include it in the video so after I do my hair most of the time I always massage my head like it uh, the hair um, the hair had been pulled so I just massage my hair for for the circulation blood circulation and all that and it feels good actually really feels good as you can see I'm just enjoying uh, massaging my hair so I'm done massaging my hair so I'll hold the half part so is that a, a hair grip yeah I think it's a hair grip if I'm not wrong correct me if I'm wrong so I started from the back side of my hair so uh, most of the time when I'm detangling my hair I go in with my fingers so first I finger detangle my hair and that's what I'm currently doing sorry my voice I have like a cold so I'm just a finger detangling and then now I go in with a white comb comb so I don't know what's the name of the comb but you guys uh, can see I've just gone in with it and that's uh, uh, I had a little hair that has come off so when you're done you can hold the hair so that it does not distract you or disturb you when you are detangling the other partition so always partition your hair into like small partitions and then finger detangle your hair like as you can see I did a partition and still partitioned it again like sectioned it into two and that's the much hair that I've uh, lost while I was like uh, finger detangling so yeah so I go in with the white comb as you see in this case so it's pretty easy yeah so I'd advise that you before you go in with the comb you can always uh, finger detangle your hair so just uh, uh, putting the other side uh, away from the hair because most of the time it's, it will always disturb you so make sure you like separate it and hold it on its own so all through this video this is what I'm doing I'm finger detangling and then I'm um, going in with a white comb 
so um, I don't think I'll need to explain the rest of the part so you just see what I do So this is the last part of the first half you guys can see the entire half how it looks that's the match that i've lost yeah so that's the detangled side as you can see it looks pretty good so this other side i've not yet uh, uh, detangled and that side looks so you can see the difference, uh, the, uh, the detangled side looks much uh, filled out, like there's much hair. This other side looks like uh, there's less hair. So I'm just like uh, kind of folding my hair so that you guys can see the difference. <music> So I did like went off so that I could start on the other half and this is the last parti partition of the second half which I'm currently uh, detangling. So I'll just finish up on that part. So I'm done. <coughs> Pardon me. I'm done and that's how my hair is after detangling. So I'm just holding it so that you guys can see both sides how they look and th that's the match I've lost during the entire process yeah that's not much hair so yeah thank you guys um, I hope I've helped someone know what to do when I'm doing their hair thank you guys